My name is Andy Gonzalez. I'm a set design major at Cal State Fullerton and I help paint the floor for Lysistrata. We first started with receiving a paint elevation of the floor, which had a man and a female on opposite sides of each other. So we decided we need to create a Xerox photocopy so we could get this half inch scale into full scale. When we got the Photoshop's copy, the, the Xerox photocopy, we put it on a projection that we were able to measure it and get a large piece of paper and trace the details on the piece of paper. When we got the trace out on a full scale size, we placed a large piece of paper on the paint shop's floor and we put a cardboard underneath the large piece of paper and we used a pounce wheel to create holes that doesn't tear the paper but just creates an outline from the projection that we traced out of. When we created the holes, then we took that piece of paper onto the actual stage floor and we used chalk and we rubbed it along the piece of paper and what that does is it creates a outline onto the stage floor. So the chalk goes through the holes onto the floor and when we remove the piece of paper we have our final outline on the stage floor on full scale. Then we are able to paint the floor with acrylic paint and we mix the colors using the paint elevation which is a lot of pinks and blues and there are different shades so we had to measure each different colors with the different shades. And we created a number by paint system so we knew which areas needed certain types of blues and reds and we created a template for the circle so each circle would be the same without having to measure each one or creating a, a pounce for each one and they will always be the same distance. The same goes with the stripes and with the stripes that we that are on the floor we had to use a sharpie to create each stripe and then paint the paint on it so that the sharpie will be seen through the paint and we were able to actually fill in the black paint on top of the sharpie so the sharpie was just a template at the end of the project we glossed the entire floor so the boxes that are being used for this show could slide on top of the floor without damaging the paint and at the end we have a final product